Just outside London, you'll find one of the strangest officers in the world. Here at Extend Robotics, staff train robots to be more human. They pack boxes, pick vegetables, even play games. Chung Liu is the man behind these machines. He's building on a technology which is already changing lives. Doctors can use telesurgery to perform remote operations on patients in other countries. Robots can even help after natural disasters, allowing rescue teams to reach places too dangerous for humans. Many of those tasks are really difficult to automate, so you, you can't really have a autonomous robots to, to complete the task. But having this remote technology would save the lives, uh, make it much more comfortable for people to work in there, um, and increase productivity. Chung was raised in China, but decided to start his business in the UK. He says Britain produces amazing software and he's added it to hardware from places like China and the US. And all that combines together, we have the best solutions. There's no doubt China is a major player in robotics. Chinese firms registered 5,700 patents for humanoid robots between late 2019 and late 2024. US companies registered 1,500, which was less than a third of China's patents. Firms around the world are racing to develop smarter, foster robots. But experts say cooperation is just as important as competition. Shan Luo is a researcher who advises the Institution of Engineering and Technology in London. He says China's robotic sector could change the world, but only if it really listens to clients in other countries. It needs a lot of collaboration with local companies to build up um, this uh, uh, knowledge into the local culture and also uh, for different uh, applications they may need different knowledge locally. So that's why collaboration is a key. Back at the Extend Robotics office, the team is hard at work. And I'm starting to realize what this tech is all about. China dominates this industry. But when you see tools like this, or this, you realize that the story of robotics is unfolding on a global scale. We believe in globalization, we believe in, we believe in uh, the opportunity to collaborate and, uh, and, and really share knowledge. Speaking of sharing, this robot even offered a hug. Not exactly warm and fuzzy, but it's learning. Yeah. And that's what robots are all about. Michael Marillia, CGTN. London.